ke banyak. Your face is scaring me. <laughs> Hello everyone. We have finally checked in here at the hotel in Hokkaido. And we are so, so, so tired because we woke up very early in the morning. It was 5 o'clock in the morning and then we left the apartment at 6. We took a flight at 9 o'clock in the morning, arrived here in Hokkaido at 12 o'clock. And then we had lunch at the airport and we took a bus ride at around 3 o'clock. And finally, arrived here at the hotel at around 6 o'clock. Am I right? Yes. Yes, and we are so excited because this is our first ever domestic trip where we had to ride on a plane. We are gonna stay here for five days and we'll see how this trip goes and we're so excited to enjoy our vacation here in Hokkaido. But anyway, so I wanna give a quick tour this hotel because the room is also nice and I just wanna show it to all of you guys. <laughs> So this is the Genkan. Actually, this room is really big. So when you enter here, there's a very big closet. And at the side is a full body mirror. Yes. And all the way here is the toilet. Yes, there's a bidet. The holy bidet, which everybody loves here in Japan. The washlet before you enter the bathroom. So... This is a really huge room and upon entering you can see two beds right there with a bathrobe and all the way here is a living room. See it's really huge <laughs> and here is the dining area. Sorry it's a little bit messy because someone is also vlogging and someone is hiding. <laughs> Just kidding. I will not say. Okay, anyway, this is the kitchen with the fridge and some kitchen utensils inside. So there are knives for cooking and some glasses and plates. There's also a rice cooker here. So everything is just convenient. There's also a microwave oven and and a humidifier and a coffee maker so basically that's everything in this room and we are gonna stay here for like three days maybe yeah three days including today and on the fourth day we're gonna go back to Sapporo have a little city tour and then go back to Osaka on the fifth day and then tomorrow we're gonna go snowboarding and I don't know how to snowboard yeah someone is really having high expectations of me Okay, so maybe that's all for today, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Oh my gosh, look at that snow. It's a huge amount of snow. Good morning, everyone! Today is officially the first tour here in Iseko. And today we are heading to Moiwa. It is a ski and snowboarding area. But before that, we will stop by to a snowboard, snowboard rental shop to borrow some things that we need before we start snowboarding. I've never tried snowboarding before. I'm so nervous right now. But somebody's gonna teach me. So if anything happens to me, it's not my fault. <laughs> right? It was snowing heavily earlier this morning. We decided to stay a little bit in the room and waited for the snow to stop. And the snow is so thick. It's almost as tall as me. So I also noticed the houses around here in Hokkaido. The roofs, the roofs are triangular. Is it to prevent the snow from piling up on top? I see. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like that one. <laughs> like that is a good example <laughs> of a roof crashing because of a heavy snow piling up on top. Wow. That's crazy! And now no one's living there. 
Yeah, no people. This is the good thing. And this is the reason why we decided to go here. Because, as you all know, Japan is strictly prohibiting tourists from visiting the country. And I think this would be the last chance for us to enjoy the place privately because once Japan lets tourists come back and visit, it will be crowded. And it's not gonna be as fun as right now anymore. So we're taking advantage of this season right now. Like literally, there's so few people. Look at that. Oh my gosh. But now I'm scared. But here we are. Moyon Ski Resort. We're back here at the hotel. It was a whole lot of fun, but yes, my body is so so tired right now. I feel like I'm gonna have a muscle pain tomorrow morning. I really enjoyed a lot today because I just realized that snowboarding is a really fun sport. Personally speaking, now that I've experienced skiing and snowboarding, I feel like snowboarding fits me better even though I'm not so good at it. But yes, I like snowboarding better than skiing. It's more fun for me. And tomorrow, we are going to go snowboarding again. Yes, for the second time around. Because today is just only a training day. I, I feel like I really did a pretty good job for today. And tomorrow, yes, I'm gonna do my best. But right now, Yuya is out. He is at the lobby waiting for his sister to bring some groceries for us because unfortunately going around in this place here in Niseko is a little inconvenient because you need to have a car in order for you to get to the places you want to go to but since his sister is living here in Niseko we are getting what we need and by the time Yuya arrives here we are gonna make some dinner we are going to make Nabe for tonight. Nabe is a Japanese traditional hot pot dish which has different varieties of soup and I'm not sure what kind of nabe we are going to make for tonight but I'm so hungry. For now, we will be having dinner. <laughs> not so spicy. I think the sauce is perfect. Like the right amount of sauce and right amount of water. It's another beautiful day and I'm guessing it snowed last night because the asphalt 
It's covered in snow again. It's always snowing here. Have you heard about summer snow? When it falls on you, your blood runs cold. But don't you sweat your pretty skin? Cause it melts away for it sinks in. And you dream about this very night. We are on top of the lift. This is the two. And let's see if I can master snowboarding until today. Because this is the last chance for me. <laughs> let's go. Until your legs gave way She's back And you cried and got back wow. up again <laughs> And it's real to think that I could fly Cross a broken bridge and the fading light Never thought I had on my two feet Never had a care in the world you see Have you heard from the sky? Yes, hello everyone! We are finally back at the hotel from Anupuri Ski Resort and I would say that today was a lot better than yesterday. So I think I was finally able to master the basic skills of snowboarding. Well, I actually did fall a few times but it was really amazing and I had a lot of fun. So today there were four people who joined us snowboarding. That's why I thought it was more fun than yesterday. I think Anupuri compared to Moiwa had a better course because they had three or four courses. So you can go from beginner course to junior course to advanced and I don't know professional but I was able to like go smoothly with the beginner course and with the junior course it was a little bit difficult but I managed to survive yay I think snowboarding is one of the best experiences for me this year and this is really a memorable experience for me that I will definitely remember for the rest of my life and since we're back at the hotel we are gonna have dinner together with the people we went snowboarding with so right now we are waiting for them and by the time that they arrive we are gonna cook dinner and eat together and have a lot of talk, have some fun, just relax until the rest of the evening. Japanese me. By the way, I would just want to show you the view from the window while it's getting dark. So it's really, really amazing. And I could stare 
at this view all day. And one more thing, so tomorrow we are gonna go back to the city, Sapporo. So, so I think this would be my last view of Miseko before we leave for tomorrow. It's really a good experience for this year. And hopefully by next year, Corona will be over. From the best cook. <laughs> Somebody has lost his wallet.